Why did you say yes when I invited you to become one of the speakers? And why does DEI matter to you that much? Well, the, the reason is twofold. One is, of course, because uh, as a person of color living in the Netherlands and building mm -hmm. my career from scratch, doing what I do and the dreams and the ambitions and, that I have, it was, of course, a challenge, but at the same time, a wealth of knowledge and understanding that I gathered. And one thing that my mentor always taught me was whenever you get, make sure that you carry, pass on the legacy forward. Mm -hmm. So if, knowledge is meaningless if, if we don't share it. Yeah. So that's one purpose that uh, with regards to this, this um, platform that you're talking about diversity, inclusion, it's so important. It's, it's the most practical way to be. Uh, at the end of the day, our workplace has to be a reflection of society. And yeah. if our society is filled with talented, smart, brilliant people of all races, colors, cultures, then why not leadership and why not the workplace? It just makes sense. Mm -hmm. And especially now that, that we're working online, that everybody is uh, connected globally uh, through a screen, the need for us to really understand for like not just foreign cultures, but understand the intricacies of different cultures, different um, ways of communication. That's so important. Diversity is practical. It's let's not even make it something um, that you know is difficult for people. It's a practical thing to do. So it's the new norm. It's the new practical. Um, and the second reason, of course, is because you asked me, and I always, you know, for me, I trust the person who invites me and that's mm -hmm. how you know that's that's the core of building meaningful relationships so when you asked me of course i had to say yes thank you thank you and i'm so honored that you are joining this summit and